Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. It has been so long since I've said that, but it feels so good. Today is my moving vlog. My husband and I are moving into our new apartment and I am so excited. I'm sure by now I've already posted some sort of like update video, kind of like where I've been. So if it's your first time here or if you have not seen my videos in a while, I would highly suggest to go back and watch that video first and then come back for the moving videos. We're currently right now getting our U-Haul. I have to go pick up the keys in about 20-ish minutes or so, so I am so excited. I I didn't film any of the like packing process we're just gonna do like kind of like the moving and like packing the u-haul probably we'll see what i can get i haven't vlogged in probably like almost two years so i'm a little rusty you guys so we also did get our favorite coffee if you guys are local to san antonio brevity is our favorite place it is so good so we're gonna go get our u-haul get the keys all that good stuff and i will update you guys later i got the keys i don't even know how to act right now I have so many emotions right now, I don't even know how to feel. But I am so excited! Um, I'm here. This is such a good feeling. I wish Matthew were here to like soak this in with me, but he is um, loading the U-Haul. But I am so excited to look at this huge window that I have in the living room. Amazing lighting, it's so good. Starting with the bedroom, I am so excited. There is so much room here for like an apartment bedroom. Um, more than enough room for a huge king size bed, which is great because that's what we have. I love this because there are two closets in here. So this one is <laughs> gonna be Matthew's closet, but it's a great size. This one is my closet, y'all. I am a little bit emotional because I have never had my own like walk-in closet like this. This just, I've just never had this much space and it's, it's like crazy. I just, I've never had this much of space and I'm just like feeling all the feels right now. Coming to our restroom, it's also a really good size again for like an apartment restroom. Definitely gonna need to get some like organization because there's only one tiny shelf, but there is so, like just so much cabinet space for organization, like so much room, like so much room. I'm excited. Now for our living room slash dining area. Let's take a look at the patio. Oh, huge patio space. And then we have a washer and dryer out here, which is pretty cool and you know that stuff. And then shelving. Here's the kitchen and I've never seen an apartment kitchen, one bedroom might add, with this much counter space. like so much space like look my arm like goes all the way back there's so much cabinet space counter space it's beautiful like i don't even think i've ever had this much like cabinet space um like in any house i've lived in regular fridge stove dishwasher so feeling very blessed right now out of the room some few items and i have this adorable cutie she just ate apples and prunes
second load. Oh, you look majestic. How's it going? The birthday woman. <laughs> She's done. <laughs> she is done. A little break from moving. We went to pick up some food. Sarah's here. Um, but we went to 54th Street to pick up food and there's like a 20 minute wait to get our order. So we came to because why not? Oh my god, I thought that was John Oh my god. We picked up food for everyone, 54th Street. I'm so hungry. A little break. How are you feeling, babe? I'm excited. <laughs> Got our own place. Woo! X-ray. Ah! <laughs> Ranger's so sad he thinks we're leaving him. Dude, come on. Go outside, my love. <laughs> we are officially moved in. We got the puppies here. And now we have all this work to do by tonight because tomorrow, like afternoonish, like around 11 to 3, we are going to be getting our bed and our couch. So, they are assembling it. We're getting it from living spaces, so that means all of this has to be gone. <laughs> midnight and we have two crazy puppies but look at all this progress i'm sitting down on the only chair that we have because i am dead tired but look at my cute little puppies oh god <sighs> he's so hyper too like oh man <laughs> he has a huge bed over here and he chooses to sleep in bella's tiny one make it make sense i i have no words <laughs> good morning guys and welcome to day two of our moving vlog um but like our first full official day in our new apartment i'm so excited it is currently 7 50 a.m we have our work cut out for us today because living spaces comes with our furniture around like 11 45 to two or three or something like that so obviously they need room to assemble our furniture so we still have some more cleaning and putting away to do so that's gonna be exciting and challenging but we can get it done today also i went to make coffee this morning we have no coffee creamer and absolutely no groceries so matthew wants to go get some coffee creamer so that we can enjoy a nice hot cup of coffee in our new apartment uh, so yeah lots of cleaning and stuff to do of course i'll bring you guys throughout my day but i cannot wait to show you all my furniture or our furniture it is so beautiful, so I'll update you guys later.
so the kitchen is, I would say, pretty almost done. Yeah, maybe like, seven, maybe like 75, 80 percent. Yes. Yeah, that's good. I agree. Coffee area, which I might rearrange again. <laughs> and Matthew pretty much set this up. It looks good. A little picky. Mm -hmm. This is not really the vibe anymore, but we're going to hang on to it for a little bit. Yeah. But it's really cute. But yeah, it looks really nice. Um, I didn't think I was gonna get all this done. And we gotta work on this. Oh, and I actually bought this for a little ottoman. But Matthew suggested this for like our keys and wallets and stuff. And then I have a little tray all the way over there on that chair. Look at the <laughs> Just face that I'm gonna use for the ottoman. So yes, I love it. And then our couch should be coming we'll be any minute, literally. What time is it? It's like 1.25. One twenty-five, and they said they'd be here from? Between 12, no, 11.45 to 2.45. 2.45. Any minute. It's a little while later. Matthew got the text that living spaces should be here any minute with our couch and our bed. So I am so excited. We thought that it would also be best that I, um, you know, go leave for a little bit and take Ranger. He's over there um, exploring his new home. But we thought it would be best that I take him out for a bit to kind of get him out of the house and not be there while they're bringing in all this, like, furniture and stuff. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to just drive around, probably go get a coffee, um, and then probably just, like, sit and chill in the car while they're done so that, um, you know, we can kind of just be away. But, yeah, it's been, it's been really good. We've got major progress and i know i've been doing a lot of time lapses and i'll show y'all kind of like an overview obviously when we get our furniture but i'm so excited we've had major major progress you guys major progress so i'm very proud of us but yeah off we go to starbucks maybe i'll get him a pup cup he's been a good boy <laughs> all right so we ended up going to a local coffee spot called brevity if you're local to san antonio it is one of my favorite spots here in san antonio and i got ranger a little pup cup since he was being such a good boy <laughs> he hasn't had one of these in a long time the living spaces is here i see their truck and our stuff is coming in so i am very excited <laughs> all right dinner is here and a little quick review oh our furniture is here but i'll show you guys after we eat because i am so hungry so we got cheese pizza from julian's so good and the mozzarella sticks. Oh, yummy. And we're finally going to use our new plates. Just wash them. I love these plates, guys. They are from Walmart. And they match, like, all of my Magnolia stuff really well. So, I'm excited and I'm hungry. It is finally furniture reveal time. And I'm so in love with all of our pieces. You can probably see the couch behind me, but I won't get up in a minute so y'all can see it. But I'm so in love with everything. I've tried filming this clip a few times already, but I'm just so tired that nothing's coming out of my mouth properly. So excuse me if I sound weird. I'm exhausted. We actually just came back from our cousin's house. They literally live a few minutes away, so it's super convenient. Um, but we went to clean our bedroom and our restroom that we were using because we have been staying there for the past few months. Um, so yeah, I'm exhausted from cleaning all that and cleaning the carpet and everything on the restroom but let's show you guys the furniture because i'm pretty sure after these clips i'm gonna shower and just like crash out for the day because i'm exhausted but let's show you guys the couch in the bed because i love it so much <laughs> all right here's our couch this is i believe the bonterra couch from living spaces with the reversible chase it is super apartment friendly i love it i love the color it's so cozy and the cool part is, is the chase is removable or reversible i should say it ended up coming on this side but i moved it over there because i thought it looked more cozy so i love it it's so comfy and we actually opted out for a coffee table i went with this um little ottoman thing just to have more storage and we can also like push it back and that way we can like both lay down or we can like kind of have one piece over here however or if you're just like wanting to just lay on it um like that way you have more room so that's pretty cool as well and there's also storage which i just mentioned which is cool so we have like all of our extra blankets and throws in there which is nice and i put this little tray here that i had from target maybe put like a little candle or something and then like the remotes and you know, if you want to put a drink down, you can. So that's pretty cool as well. So I love it. It looks so good. Now it's time for the bed reveal. 
here she is so beautiful the bed is not made by the way i was like you know what i'm just gonna show them because it's all right it's okay if the bed's not made um i'm washing everything so that's good i still wanted to show you guys the bed i forgot what this is called but i will also link it it's also from living spaces as well but it's so beautiful i love the style and there's also these like built-in drawers here for like more storage and this is like a platform bed so you don't need any box springs because can you imagine because i feel like it's so high already i feel like i'm gonna have to like jump on it just to get on it um but she's a beauty and we still have so much room it definitely needs to be centered i don't know why it's not centered but we're gonna get it centered and there's gonna be so much room and then we're probably gonna get either the matching dresser to this or probably just like a dresser from ikea and put it here and if i can fit a desk hopefully right there so we'll see but yes you guys i'm obsessed it's so pretty so i think i'm gonna go ahead and hop off on today's vlog i feel like today was like a lot of time lapses but i had so much like organizing and like um just unpacking to do so I believe this is obviously probably going to be like a weekly vlog. So I'll come back and film tomorrow. Tomorrow my plan of action is the closet because my closet needs major help. So I'm probably going to do that tomorrow and try to rest because I'm just so tired. I've been going, going, going. I mean, I have rested here and there, which was nice. And obviously Matthew's helping me and he's like doing most of the work, to be honest. Um, but yeah, I'm just exhausted. So I think I'm going to put the pans away, wash them, kind of just like tidy up because there's like boxes everywhere. Take a shower and then hop in bed because your girl's tired. Oh, I, have to, I also have to make the bed because everything is in the washer still. Oh shoot, I have to put them in the dryer. So I'm gonna go do that. So thank you guys for watching the portion of, or the portion of this vlog, today's portion of the vlog. And I will probably see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Silly me to think we can actually, you know, rest and relax tonight. Turns out, <laughs> living spaces, okay, so you know how I told y'all that it was, like, off-centered? Well, we took the mattress off to move the bed, and those little, like, black little pieces that hold up the panels, the legs. the legs, yeah, there was three of them on the floor, like, just chilling there, and so I told Matthew, I'm like, why is that there? So he was looking at it, turns out this entire thing was installed incorrectly, so guess who has to fix it? A real man. <laughs> Yeah, so we're doing that right now, but I did call Living Spaces, and apparently, like, these guys had to send them a photo, like, when they're done with the job, and he's like, yeah, this whole thing was done wrong, so they were kind yeah. and sent us our money back, so. Getting that installation feedback. Yeah. It's just like that old saying, this is for all you millennials out there. You want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. And this That's is a true. prime example. Yeah, because we were like, Matthew was like, oh, you know what, like, it's fine, delivery and installation, 100 the bucks. last two days, we've been moving so much stuff and packing and signing contracts and just all the stuff that goes into getting into an apartment and finally <laughs> up until maybe i don't know an hour ago i was thinking yeah we're gonna go to walmart and we're gonna go get some like snacks and we're gonna finally chill and I'll get some dvds because we have no internet yeah, but we have we found the dvd that's player a whole other issue. yeah we're gonna go get a couple of dvds and be like yeah we're gonna chill and eat and have a good time and of course thank god my lovely wife being was so picky she's like no, the bed's not standing, we gotta it's move really it. Not. So I was like, well, let's take the mattress off because it'll be lighter. And as soon as I took it off, I instantly saw it. And yeah. then my wife, who doesn't do things like this, was like, you know, I don't know much about this, but something ain't right. Yeah, it was not right. So now we're fixing it. And Matthew had a, yeah, it's it's a lot. He literally had to like squeeze. <laughs> I missed that, but. Yeah, you know, hey, thick boys do it better. We have our first cooked meal in our new apartment. <laughs> we made ramen in our super awesome ramen noodle bowls. Mm -hmm. Delicious. Came with chopsticks. It did. But I um, don't know how to use them, so Matthew has these like beginner ones. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's yep. how you start. That's how you start. Yeah. Good morning, guys. Today is day three of the moving vlog. It's what's today? Wednesday? Oh, Wednesday. Today's Monday. Today is Monday. <laughs> I don't know. I thought it was Wednesday. It's been a long yeah. couple of days of moving, y'all. It sure has. Um, we just got to HEB. Um, it's around 8.30, and we are going to grocery shop for all of the stuff that we need. Sorry about the sun. I wasn't there a second ago, but yeah, we're going to bring you guys along to HEB, or I might do a TikTok, so we'll see. Thank you.
$300 later, but we got all this stuff and literally every sauce and condiment and like seasoning you can possibly think of. Gotta have the spicy ketchup. We finally have internet. Oh, we're still unpacking. You wanna show, let me show you guys the mess that's in our bedroom. Oh um, or should I say the mess that's in the closet? Oh yeah, it's, well, it's kind of in both rooms. Let's go. I feel like it's progress, but, oh, bed is not really set up, but oh my gosh. I had the best night's sleep. Matthew said he did not. No, I slept good. It's just, I guess it's like maybe a new place. Yeah, so I like... slept so good though. So that's all that matters. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> okay, so um, all of the stuff that was in my closet, this is literally everything that was in my closet is out here because we noticed, I guess, um, that one of the little things was coming out. Like when we, before we moved in, I guess we didn't notice it right away. Um, or I guess we just didn't pay attention. And so they're gonna come fix it, but since it's not like a major issue, they're not gonna like come right away. This could be any time this week. So um, all my clothes are just in bags still on the floor. Oh, all of those clothes. No, <laughs> let me let me tell you. Let me take the camera. Come with me, guys. Watch this. Okay, this is just a portion of what and, is and hers. And these are not even my clothes. Those yeah, but the, clothes. that's a portion of what she has. <laughs> There's a bunch of stuff over here right okay that's her whole closet you want to see my closet <laughs> boom it's like done the irony like, boom i never have ever had this huge walk-in closet in my life and i was so emotional over it and like excited and i can't even use it it's like god's like now is not the time you gotta humble yourself humble For real. yourself but it's not a big deal it'll get fixed and she'll have her full-size closet Oh, I got my little cubby hole over there. <laughs> um, we got AT and T fiber now, and the guy did a really good job. He even like, like did this against the wall so that the internet sits up there. Cause before it was like not done properly, and um, now it is. So that's cool. But yeah, we're gonna go to Sprouts and get our food because I'm hungry, and it is what time is it? Five thirteen. Just in time for traffic. <laughs> Literally. We just got back from Sprouts. Matthew went to take Ranger outside, so let's do a little Sprouts haul. My butt always does that. All right, y'all, let's do a little Sprouts haul. So I love my H-E-B, but your girl loves Sprouts and Whole Foods, so we got a lot of goodies from Sprouts. Starting over here, we got some chicken tikka masala, a little frozen meal, um, a Caesar bacon chop kit, looked really good, some flour tortillas or cassava flour from Siete. I haven't had these in a while, so I'm excited to try these again. Some eggs. We're going to have steak for dinner tonight. I believe we are. So we got some mac and cheese and some green beans for that. And I also got this um non-dairy oat milk ice cream i've been trying to find in one that has like oat milk in it or like oat milk as the dairy source so i'm excited to try this one some um vanilla we also have some heavy cream for cold foam some crema we have some caesar i got these little i guess frozen dipped strawberries they remind me of the true fruit ones so i'm excited to try these if you guys love like pinto refried beans these are the best ones. I've tried literally like all the canned ones and I always add like butter, salt, pepper, garlic to them. These don't need anything. They're so good on its own. So love this. We also got some plums. Um, this is also my favorite like pre-packaged kind of canned vodka sauce. It is so good. It tastes so similar to like a real authentic garlic or not. I guess it probably, I don't know if it is authentic, but kind of like a restaurant style. It's so good. We got some apples. Some lemons, bananas, carrots, oat milk. We got some frozen um, strawberries and this little mix for some smoothies. Shredded chicken, so I'm probably gonna make like flautas or like tosadas tomorrow. We also got a beet, because Matthew wants to juice. I saw these, I love anything honey and cinnamon, so I'm gonna try these little cracker deals. We got some turkey bacon, and then here are our steaks. Um, we got this one and then this one. I'm not really like a steak person, but I've been really loving the way Matthew makes them. So we got a boneless Angus beef ribeye. And then I believe it's the same one, but it's just organic or no grass fed. So that one's grass fed. 
some hot dog buns and i th or not hot dog buns but we also got some american style kobe beef hot dogs and some brioche hot dog buns so yeah that's it i'm gonna put all of this away and then show you guys our dinner which i hope we have the steak tonight because i'm so hungry dinner is served so good thanks to this guy right here <laughs> he's waiting but yes steak looks amazing we got mac and cheese green beans so good and some virgin river and the puppies of course <laughs> <laughs> well, Mama, you so happy. Jesse does. <laughs> Sarah is shopping somewhere. Oh, we haven't updated the vlog today, babe. <sighs> today, featuring this one. Cuteness alert. Look at her. She loves a camera. <laughs> see if we can find a table and a dresser wish us luck they didn't have the dresser we wanted in stock but they had the chairs so now i'm trying to cheer up my wife because she's being a little grumpy pants because she's like you should have got it when i had the, the u-haul and the truck and all this stuff that's why we got a little compact car but i'm sorry i was moving a whole our whole lives to one place i didn't have time to do all that so i'm doing my best i'm just one man <laughs> yes so they have the table that we wanted so at least we're gonna have a table and chairs today yeah, so maybe i'll can like comment and be like don't worry darling it takes time to you know fill up your home and all that it doesn't happen in just 24 hours whatever all right matthew's gonna work on our tables and chairs quite her almost there <laughs> so while matthew was doing that i made his dinner this looks pretty right but this is the reality so this looks so good i cannot wait to eat this i made my flautas if you guys want me to make it on the camera next time i can try to do that but it's so good mm. and it's really really easy but these look delicious well hey guys it's a little while later um, I think the last clip I may have showed was breakfast or making coffee or something. Um, we kind of took the morning to just kind of like relax, but I'm feeling energized enough to come in and tackle the closet. I feel like every day since we've been here, it's been go, go, go. Today's Wednesday. So we've been here for one, two, three, five days, four days already. Um, and I finally got the shelf in my closet fixed. I think I told y'all, but the part that like went into the wall to like keep it up was coming out. So we had to wait for maintenance to come fix that. They finally came and I can finally set up my closet. I am so excited. I have never had a closet this big. Um, I don't know. I'm pumped. I can have all my clothes out. I can have all my bags out, my shoes out. I don't need to have stuff in like another closet or like in bins. And I'm just really excited because i've never like ever had like a big closet at matthew's condo i had like a little walk-in closet but i've just never had one this size and i'm just feeling so blessed and it's like a really good feeling let's set it up let's fill it up with all the things i will say some of the stuff is already in there like my shoes so let me show y'all so i actually had the bags of like all my clothes on the floor because i couldn't put anything on the shelves but after they fixed that one that's one that was like messed up matthew put like all my boots up because like i can reach it but it's definitely easier for him to do it and then i put all my shoes up and then over here i just kind of have like some heels and sandals but guys, I've never had my shoes all in one place, like, like out like this, ever. So I am so pumped. I think here I'm going to do, like, jewelry and 
bags. We'll see what fits. So I'm going to play around with it. Um, but I have to get all of this stuff out and then put it back in. So let's go do that. <laughs> This is where we are at so far and I think my plan to have like purses here might actually not work because you can see the whole like the clothes hang kind of low so I might end up putting these shoes on the floor actually and putting my purses there but I just like wonder like what do I put here since there is like a shelf here so yeah I'm gonna figure this out so yeah i'm also out of breath so let's do this okay i think we have some progress <laughs> i ended up moving my shoes like sneakers and stuff and like other like low boots down there because i want to put my purses up here but here's kind of the system we have we kind of have graphic tees cropped tees like nicer blouses cropped blouses and then we have like dressier things and then we have like sweatshirts sweaters these are all things that, like, I have, like, to shoot, like, upcoming, which I need a better system for that. And there's more stuff over there that I have to shoot that's still in packages. And then these are all, like, dresses and then kind of, like, fancier things and longer pieces. So that's kind of the situation right now. But I thought I was done, you guys. And there's another trash bag of clothes. Oh, my gosh. And there's one right there. Oh. Oh, and then I didn't get to tell y'all. I put my coats and stuff, like, not coats, but, like, jackets down there. But I don't like how they, like, touch the floor. So, if y'all have any suggestions on how to reorganize this, let me know. I for sure want my boots up here because, like, I don't want them to get messed up. And I think that they're just safer up there. So, that's staying there. But any suggestions for this, please let me know. It's a little while later. Um... Today's been a different day, I guess. It's my first full day at the apartment without Matthew. He did go back to work today because he was off for like a few days, which was really nice for the move and everything. But he won't get home till um, later this evening. So I've just been here, I've been like cleaning. I cleaned the living room, swept, mopped, and all that stuff. And I just made some dinner, as you guys can tell, it's probably a mess back there. But I made my favorite vodka pasta with a little salad and I'm gonna enjoy that and watch some YouTube videos and just, you know sit here and rest my husband because it feels weird without him like it's just so quiet but i'm gonna show you guys my dinner because it looks so good and i want to eat it because it just looks so good so let's show you guys my dinner here's my beautiful dinner i cannot wait to eat this i have my favorite vodka sauce i showed you guys from my sprouts haul earlier this week and then i also made that caesar salad with the same um haul it's like the bacon caesar it looks so delicious i'm gonna eat this on our new table that matthew made us or built us the one that we got from ikea in our chair i'm gonna watch some youtube and enjoy my night i eat this yummy food mm -hmm. 